Okay, so now we want to add some mathematics to this uh, image. Looking at this, we'd probably want to have the kids model it with a quadratic. So we're going to put in a quadratic function in the input bar. Here's a little pro tip for you. Over here is the uh, symbols menu. So you can get a square. Okay, and GeoGebra asks you if you want sliders. Yes, please, we'll take some sliders. That was last week's GeoGebra chat. And now it's time to man manipulate those sliders to fit that curve. Well, this is going to be a black on black, which is probably not the best deal. So let's right click on the function, open its object properties, and change its color. Let's go with the uh, red. Close the object properties, and we're ready to manipulate those sliders. So we know we want A to be negative and little, and we want H about there, and K about there. Now, if you want finer control, or if your values are not uh, big enough or whatever, you can right click on the slider, open its properties, and change them. So for example, we know that A is, does not need to be down as far as negative five, so we can make it from negative one, enter, oops, there goes my mouse, to one, and instead of going by tenths, let's go by hundredths. Okay, so now I have finer control over A, and you get the point. And there you go.